There's a new Y in town. The West Suburban YMCA has been looking for decades to add another location on the south side of Newton, and the isolation of COVID intensified that search. In the summer of 2020, they found what they were looking for on Wells Ave in Newton. Previously a Boston sports club, the West Suburban YMCA purchased the building in March of 2022 and renovated the entire building in nine months, creating a new 61,000 square foot state-of-the-art facility. We all know that the social, emotional, and physical health of our kids has suffered during the shutdown of the past three years, the isolation with seniors, and just being able to bring the families back together in a healthy, nurturing environment. We're really excited to welcome thousands of residents and local individuals to come to the facility and actually begin to bond and to begin to work on their life skills to make them healthier. Members of the Newton Corner location and the Wells Ave location can use both facilities if needed. The children on the south side of the city and all the families will now have easy access to all different kinds of programming, fitness programming, social emotional programming, child care, camp. Um, obviously behind me we have the basketball courts and pickleball and volleyball and um, all different kinds of athletic programming as well. The Wells Ave YMCA officially opened on December 15th with a ribbon cutting ceremony and a tour of the facility. People lined up and couldn't wait to get in. Once they were in, they toured the different parts of the new building. Previously, there were four tennis courts in this space. We transformed the tennis courts. Um, it's a 24,000 square foot space. We, um, we built four full basketball courts. Each basketball court um, is high school size. And in addition to the fact that we have pickleball available as well as volleyball. So uh, we can also play indoor soccer. We have um, indoor lacrosse, um, instructional training. So we plan to offer many different kinds of programs to serve the needs of the community in whatever way best fits. We have 42 pieces of cardio equipment. Um, we have treadmills, recumbent bikes, upright stationary bikes, ellipticals, um, aimed AMTs, Stairmaster. So we have pretty much any type of cardio equipment. Um, anyone needs to use. Um, in addition to the fact down below in our fitness center, we have um, HIT type equipment, high intensity training equipment. We have free weights, we have selectorized equipment, um, and all kinds of personal training available for whatever um, type of workout anyone is interested in or in, in whatever way they want to improve their health or fitness level. We have a full 25 yard pool and it's a uh, lap lanes and swim lessons. And in addition to the fact um, it has four lanes, we'll keep it at anywhere from 82 um, to 80 degrees, and it will be open year round. This is a space where um, any parent or guardian can bring their child um, to play and, and be babysat while they work out in the space. We also have a work lounge. So if a parent or, or guardian preferred to do work and go up into our work lounge and jump, jump on their laptop while their child was here in our kids' corner and our babysitting room, we would welcome that. The West Suburban YMCA is a charitable nonprofit organization and has been a fixture in the Newton community for over 145 years. They're hopeful that their commitment to strengthening the foundations of the community by supporting youth development, healthy living, and social responsibility will continue for any Newton resident or nearby neighbor with their enhanced services. We're hoping to serve between two and 3,000 members. Um, and those are households, so it'll be about 6,000 individual people um, from all abilities. And one thing that's unique with the Y is that we provide financial assistance on a sliding scale. So again, we're focused on providing access to everybody regardless of social economic background or what type of program or service they want. As an example, we're partnering with a number of organizations like Newton Wellesley, Mass General Brigham, Physical Therapy, UMass, Amherst at the Mount Ida campus, and an organization called Angelfish, which is going to be teaching kids with autism how to swim. Uh, in addition, we have unique basketball programs that we're going to be bringing online uh, that are going to be able to instruct kids in both competitive basketball, but wraparound services 
in order that the Y can embed some of their character building programs. And we're doing that with an organization called the Mass Commanders as well. So we have something for everybody here at the Wells Ave Y. Many people are extremely happy to have another YMCA in the community, including Newton Mayor Ruth Ann Fuller. The Y cares about people of all ages, young, young toddlers up to our oldest residents. They're here for people who are hungry, who need joy and health, they, people who are seeking uh, community and swimming, you name it. Great people, great facility. We're thrilled to have them over here on Wells Avenue. More information about the Wells Ave YMCA is available online at wsymca.org. Jen Adams, Newton News, Newton Center.